I ate like three million calories. I don't like this. Damn. Hey, if you're new here, I'm Asia G, and if you're not, welcome back. So today's supposed to be a cardio only day. However, I just got a text message, and I already kind of knew this too, that the new gym uh, that I signed up for opened yesterday, and I'm supposed to be able to actually record in this gym legally. I want to go test them. I want to pack my camera up and go in and just do cardio at the gym instead of doing it at home on the treadmill. We're going to see, because I might get in there and start doing something that's, oh, I want to do that, and then I want to record like a reel, like a funny reel for Instagram. My version of funny might not be Instagram version of funny. I'm trying to think what I would got to do today. Oh, I need to clean up. I always need to clean up. But it's like whenever company comes to stay like for a day or two, it's like you feel like your house has to be immaculate. Our house is very lived in. It's ish everywhere. Do y'all keep your house immaculate like all the time? I've dated somebody and when I tell you her house was immaculate you could eat off the floor. I mean, you wouldn't eat off the floor, but you could. Everything had a spot, and it, and it was like that. Whether she was at home, her vehicle was like that, her desk at work was like that. I am not like that. Like, I will clean up and straighten up, and it's gonna be clean and straightened for like a day, maybe two days. Then it's gonna be organized for like a week, and then it's gonna be back ish everywhere, like, at, I know like just out of a week it's, it's everywhere and then I do it all again and then of course like we watch a lot of Instagram or YouTube and stuff and like they houses be together my house is not together I be pushing shit out the frame so y'all don't see it <laughs> take this tree down because it is December 30th and I'm gonna get this tree down before tomorrow I feel like I'm becoming allergic to contacts. This is very random. Has this ever happened to y'all? Like, I feel like my contacts are poking my eyeball all the time. All the time. And I need to change my solution. But this is uncomfortable. Okay, let's see the outfit. I've been trying to resist buying new workout clothes because I own so much. But I also want some new stuff. And as y'all can see, I ate like every calorie I saw during the holidays. Like if it was a calorie that I ate it. And like this is no exaggeration. I ate like 3 million calories. <laughs> Over like the past month and a half. Like I know I have. And this was so good when I tell you every chocolate, every cookie, every cake, I ate it. So even though like I was like eating everything that I saw having like the best time of my life. I was still like hitting all my workouts. Which is fine because... We still look good. And I'm a thicker girl anyway. Like, I'm just juicing me and my fupa, my big old legs. We're going to live this life together. So, there's nothing to stress about. I hope y'all ate every calorie y'all saw too. Everybody like, don't wait till the new year. Girl, just go and wait. If you waited till the new year, ain't nothing wrong with that, okay? Because I'm trying to get back on 2,000 calories. But them cookies, cakes, and chocolates is calling me. I am so proud of myself. Not for working out because I do that anyway, but for still going to the gym and like it's almost four o'clock. Anything after one, I'd be like, I'm just gonna work out at home. But I really wanna go to the new gym, test them to see if they're gonna say something to me about my camera so that I can know if I need to cancel it. Cause that's the only reason I got this gym membership. So at the moment they be like, ma'am, you can't record in here. My petty ass is gonna be like, thank you. I would like to cancel my gym membership. I'm gonna try to, um, Record this reel that I want to do. So today is supposed to be cardio only before the reel. Like I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show y'all. Even though it's a reel for Instagram, I end up uploading it onto YouTube as a short. So I'll probably put it in this video because I should do that before I actually edit this video, and then y'all can see like how it turned out. But today is supposed to be a cardio day. So I got a new gym membership. I got uh, so I got a new gym membership. So I got a new gym, so. Damn, I forgot to do cardio. Damn, I forgot to do cardio. Damn, I forgot to do cardio. This is a new gym and it's nothing special about this gym. It is just like a regular box gym, a chain gym, but it does have way more equipment 
and then it has way more updated equipment than like my home gym has also like with it having more equipment it has like a wall of squat racks which my home gym usually only have two to three squat racks and then i'm usually like waiting for a squat rack like if it's a really busy day the other thing that i really was like impressed with is that it has like a boxing section your girl can't box but it's not anything that YouTube University can't teach me. I have been thinking about taking some boxing classes. We got like a rumble boxing here in Memphis that just opened. It's hella loud in here like with house music. I, I don't like that. I don't like that. And I usually can jam with the gym music. The gym music, probably alcohol, like alcohol. But now I don't really just have to unless I need to know like a lot of technical stuff. But I can just try it out at the gym to see if I even like like the movements and doing a bunch of different like little boxing moves. And I'm aware that I say like a lot. I don't know when I started that. I'll take it back. Do what you're going to Now, what my home gym does have over this new gym is that my home gym has several locations and it has pools, which is why I'm gonna just keep both gym memberships, which would be great for me. I remember thinking when I first started watching like a bunch of workout videos and people who were into fitness that would have two and three gym memberships and I thought that was like excessive and I thought that was crazy but I definitely can see how each gym have like their own perks and how having a couple of different gyms actually will probably fit your routine better like if you could afford it and of course the greatest thing about having this new gym membership is that I can record freely I checked with staff when I went in they confirmed that I could and funny enough I saw a guy in there recording with like a big tripod his Sony camera and a large lens my heart going about to bust out <laughs> And today was definitely a cardio day, but like I was telling y'all in the car, I wanted to record a reel. So I ended up doing a like a full body workout because I needed all of those exercises to go into the clip. So I tried to do like between two and three sets of all of these exercises in addition to doing my 30 minutes on the treadmill. Just like that, Christmas is over and New Year's is here. So I just need to vacuum where I took the tree down, which may or may not happen today. So I'm gonna go through like my legging stash and sports bra and try to clean out the stuff that I don't wear because I do like buy stuff. And then sometimes I feel guilty about buying stuff because I'm like, I have like a closet full of leggings and workout clothes and sports bras, but really I don't wear them all. So I just need to go through and just try to organize it. So let's go to this closet that's never clean. And we're going to try to organize it. Did I show y'all some of the stuff I got for Christmas? J just go with me. My sister got me this chef hat because I be cooking <laughs> and she's a chef. Whenever I go to the Nike store, I was always looking at these shoes. They're so cute. It's not a Whitney Houston fit, but like when she sang the national anthem. Oh, say can you see? Hey. And I got the pants to them. Ready to get out of this white dirty thing. And that's how you know you'll be causing attention. Okay, y'all. So this is where I keep all of my leggings and stuff. And it's just like stuffed in a drawer. So I kind of know which ones I want to keep. So I bought like all of these glow leggings, but I got them in sizes small. And I am now a medium. And like I said, I'm accepting that like I grew these thighs, I grew this butt, and I've been eating. Skipping on the sidewalks of my mind. And everything is gonna be alright When we were brand new we used to shine Before 
change later i finally finished and let me show y'all what i did so this is like the giveaway pad or really i'm gonna take this stuff to plato's closet and see if they would buy i feel like they would definitely try to offer me something for the sets probably nothing not a lot so i have six sets that have like the matching top and bottoms so i feel like they may buy those and then I have like a lot of the glow leggings that were smalls. They're too small. But I feel like they're some really good colors. And that they may buy those. And then I also just decided to get rid of these boots. And they told me the last time that I went in there. That they kind of cater to a younger demographic. And I feel like those really tall over the knee boots that are high heels as well as like the workout stuff they may actually buy this time and then i had like a couple of other pieces that i was holding on to that i wanted to wear at least one more time before i got rid of like the last time i did a closet clean out i have this like little ralph lauren sweater that fit me terribly but i wore it for the first time so i was like okay so i can let that go because i gotta wear it at least once think they may take this some stuff that i was gonna get tailored i'm just like absolutely not asia just let it go like some little jeans that i got from target let me see maybe i can still fit these i don't think i can oh okay i'm hold on to these and i was gonna get this gap skirt took in in the back but my booty height skirts up too much and Let's just leave it alone. That's the stuff that I'm giving away. And then I just got another giveaway pad that I know Play-Doh's closet would be like, we do not want that, which is that stuff. And then I finally finished up in the closet. It don't look nothing like how everybody else's stuff look like when they clean out their legs. Like, it be looking neat. I don't possess that skill. So, I cleaned out, I mean, three drawers. And so these are my leggings. So that's what, and I just put the leggings on this side, and then I put the shorts on this side. And then I tried to color coordinate, like, at the end. I'm not sure how well I did, but I tried. Those are the leggings and shorts for the gym. And then these are the sports bras. I tried to color coordinate these as well. I feel like it's a better way to do sports bras, but for right now, that I have to work. And I feel like this one, you can see it like the color coordination attempt for sure. Well, until you get like right up into these blues and greens. And the third joy is like, it's a mix because I didn't have enough space. Just like covers like for the gym to go with my sports bras. And then this was just like random shirts that I still had. But this part is the gym part. And then of course, like I run and I didn't organize this, but I put like all my running shorts and tops I just stuffed them in this drawer so <laughs> we're not gonna worry about that but that's it then I move my socks here then I move like the fun sleepwear here I'm a bit more organized than I was and I feel like that's gonna start off like a really really good new year so we'll just add that to like organize check so I'm gonna end the video here I feel like I'm ready to go into this new year honing in on me and just being more comfortable in my own skin and I hope that 2023 is everything that we take action to make it to be the word for 2023 is action if y'all stayed this long type action down in the comment box because that's what we doing los toros de año hmm those mil even the threes 
in my mind it says 2023. Oh, dos mil y I feel like that's correct. Anyway, you guys, here's to another year. And of course, I will see you guys next time. Until then.